Hi, this is Asin. You are now watching Asin Math TV. In this video, we will learn how to obtain the probability for binomial distribution by using Keyshare calculator. Consider the random variable x follows binomial distribution with n equal to 8 and p equal to 0 0.2. A. Determine the probability for x is equal to 3. First, press menu. Look for the 7 function distribution. Choose 4 binomial PD probability distribution. Since we are asked for only one value, which is x is equal to 3, choose 2 variable. x equal to 3, press equal, n equal to 8, equal, e equal to 0 0.2, equal. Press equal again and we should obtain the correct probability. Half B for an interval. We have three methods here. First, press menu, distribution, binomial PD4, list. We need two, three, four, and five. So we put two, three, four, five. Press equal, N equal to eight, P equal to 0 0.2, correct. And we should obtain a list of probabilities and we can sum the values manually and obtain the correct probability the second method press menu distribution binomial pd4 choose variable x is equal to 2 press equal and we should store the probability in a store press equal x is equal to 3, press equal, store in B, equal, x equal to 4, equal, equal, store C, equal, 5, equal, equal, store D. Press menu, go to the first function, calculate, and we should calculate alphabet a plus alphabet B plus alphabet C plus alphabet D. Press equal and obtain the correct probability. Or the last method menu, look for the distribution 7, press down, look for binomial CD, cumulative distribution. We have to bear in mind that this calculator only works for less than cumulative which means that we want to have up to 5 and minus up to 1 since we need 2 so which means that we should remove 0 and 1 only we shouldn't remove 2 so every time we should change for the lower limit from equal to without equal then we'll definitely correct so we have 1 variable x is equal to 5 the upper limit n equal to 8 p equal to 0 0.2 press equal and we should store this value in a press equal change x to 1 press equal equal store the value in b again press menu go back to the first function calculate alphabet a minus alphabet b Press equal and we should obtain the correct probability. And we done. Okay, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this. See you.